The next plugin we're going to take a look at is the CSV plugin, CSV standing for Comma Separated Value. This was originally inspired when I saw the Tests plugin that's a standard part of the Explorer. A table gets produced showing configuration problems or potential issues, but there's no way of exporting that to an external medium such as a spreadsheet. So I wrote the CSV plugin to handle that. It hooks into the Explorer, exports the table as a CSV format. It can then be imported into any spreadsheet easily or indeed into text editors and anything else that knows how to handle that format. But having worked with the tests output, I then decided to look at some of the other opportunities that we have with in the Explorer to export other information from within it. Here we're looking at a list of the, some of the queues in the Explorer and what we can see is a set of queues and all of the attributes. Up in the top right there's a toolbar with a number of standard operations but there's also a new one with the save icon. Again we can export that table exactly as it stands to a CSV file and work with it and most of the other tables within the Explorer are also exportable. There are a couple that aren't that don't really make a lot of sense because although they look like tables they're really just sets of independent columns. It's not only uh, queue manager attributes, we can also export things from the JMDI repository and a lot of the other tables that you see in the Explorer. The latest enhancement in version 7103 allows us to export things from other tables which are produced in pop-up windows. Now here there's no toolbar to hook into, but by right-clicking on contents of the table you see a new option to save the table as a CSV and again that is exported. When we look at the tables, the text file that have been produced, we can see the contents of it. And then importing that into a spreadsheet, all of the usual operations are available. So here I've imported it into Excel and you can see the columns with the names and all of the attributes that are shown. This plugin doesn't do any semantic analysis, it doesn't understand the attributes, all it's doing is exporting the text. So if you've applied filters or schemes to select different objects and show different attributes, that is exactly what will be exported to the CSV tables. The final example is where I've exported the application connections and here we can see the programs that are connected to the queue manager along with channel names, IP addresses, all of the application connection status information. So that's one more plugin in MS0P, the CSV exporter, making it easy to extract information from the GUI.